Tonight, investigators tell us that suspect was driving around 100 miles per hour at the time of the crash. Tonight, he's behind bars facing felony charges while a little boy has to say goodbye to his dad. Dan Keen was on his way to work Sunday when the single father was struck and killed in a crash near Mannheim and Irving Park Road. My son had a green light. He was going to work so early in the morning because he wanted to get out earlier and spend time with his son after work. And he hit him. He boned him. The 46 year old leaves behind a young son who also lost his mom to cancer just three years ago. My grandson has two empty holes that will never be ever filled ever. He doesn't have a mom and a dad now because of this stupidity. The crash happened around 4 o'clock Sunday morning. Investigators say Nicholas Quinones ran a red light, then smashed into Keene's car. The 27-year-old now facing reckless homicide charges. The gentleman did not take responsibilities for his action. Instead, he took my son's life away. According to court documents, this all started when Franklin Park Police pulled over the suspect for erratic driving. Officers say they noticed his speech was slurred and smelled alcohol on his breath. Moments later, investigators say Quinones took off, driving around 100 miles an hour. Police say he then blew through at least two red lights before he struck and killed Keen. I'm not upset with the police. The police were doing their job. I'm upset with the man who did not follow police instructions. The sixth grader losing both parents, family coming together to support him. Investigators say more charges could still be filed. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.